Welcome back to Design Thinking and Innovation. We are going to be doing uh, the project section. We have just finished with uh, the tools that you need to do and it is ideation part 1 and week 9. It is section P9, week 9. So, we are going to be doing what we just studied at uh, tool section, uh, the four methods for ideation, brainstorming followed by idea sketching, then use of the scamper techniques and then lateral thinking. Uh, the idea is that, that you get a lot of ideas and you visualize it in form of sketching and then we will put it together. So, the content is brainstorming, idea sketching, scamper and lateral thinking. Then collate all the ideas together in this section and we will prioritize the ones which you think are good. So, let us look at the project. Uh, we will do four things, brainstorming, idea sketching, scamper and lateral thinking. Uh, each one builds upon another and so that you get a bunch of ideas or several ideas. We start with brainstorming, very simple, you need to think of keywords connected with the topic, uh, which is basically you already done the restatement of the problem. So, you need to find solutions to the problem, right. Any ideas that you get, you put it down on a piece of paper, you can sit with your friends to brainstorm. Okay. Once you got enough ideas on this, you move on to idea sketching. Make very simple sketches of the brainstormed ideas that you have. Okay. So, you have a whole lot of things which you already visualized. Okay. Once you do idea sketching, you go on to a technique called scamper where you actually modify your idea sketches. Okay. Scamper is an acronym of seven letters, each one stands for a technique. S is substitute, C is combined with another idea, A is adopt another idea, M is modify your idea, P is put it to another use, E is eliminate parts which are not so essential and R is reverse or inverse the idea. So, seven techniques by which you can actually refine the ideas that you already sketched. Okay. And then we go on to a very nice technique called lateral thinking, which is as against vertical thinking. Normally, we do vertical thinking. That means that if you got an idea, you try to make the idea better and better, not realizing actually the solution lies somewhere else. Okay. So, as against this vertical thinking, you need to think laterally. So, you might have to actually dig a hole in a different place, in a different size, in a different combination. Okay, so, this is called as lateral thinking. So, you are basically whatever ideas you got, you are actually relooking at it and finding more ideas. Okay, so, so that is how your ideation will increase and you have a kitty of ideas with you. Okay, so, let us look at the steps. Note down the restatement of the problem connected with your topic. This is very, very important, uh, the restatement of the problem. Based on that, do ideation connected with your topic. You can brainstorm as many ideas as possible. Okay, stop when you really run out of it. Okay, you can sit with your friends and do it. Then quickly sketch. These are very rough sketches. Okay, but it kind of tells you what the idea is. That makes it become visible. Okay, so these concepts or ideas you need to sketch them. It's rough sketches. Okay, the ideas that you got through brainstorming, now you have visualized. Okay. And then you go on to the technique, what we just described, the scamper techniques. It is seven methods through which you can actually refine the ideas and improve the ideas. Okay. So, that is the third technique. Okay. And the fourth technique is lateral thinking, which is actually trying to find a solution in another place in a different way okay, or thinking differently. Okay, so, make use of lateral thinking to further refine your ideas. 
Okay, then what you have is you have a lot of ideas now. You make a list of all these ideas. Uh, you need to make sure that your ideas are unique and different from each other. So, make a full list of them. Okay, so that is the exercise you need to do in this project. Okay. Now, make a list of all your ideas. Okay, so, uh, it is a complete list okay, of the unique ideas and along with that you also have the idea sketches. So, it is very easy to look at them. You can compare the ideas, uh, you can mark the ones that look promising. Okay. Uh, you can even get feedback at this stage from users because you have a whole lot of ideas and uh, just talk to them, show them your ideas, get feedback and mark the words that could be improved. Okay. So, that is really the project that you need to do for this week. So, thanks a lot for listening. So, please complete the project. This is section P 9, week 9. Let us do a summary of what we have done till now. Okay, we did the design process uh, ideation part 1, uh, basically looking at different techniques of ideating creative ideas. Uh, we looked at brainstorming, idea sketching, scamper and lateral thinking, these were the tools and you applied this in your project to generate further concepts and sketch these to visualize them. And now, we look at a very interesting case study, where ideation has been used. The project is called as Geolites. It is application of photovoltaic explorations. It is an exploratory project. So, let us have a look at it in the next section.